Here we are again at a local grocery store asking consumers what questions they have for farmers. I don't know, see like I'd get attached to the animals so probably how could you not get attached? Providing this edition's answer is Charity Bathurst who lives on a farm in Dickinson County with her six children and husband Jeff. The family's farm includes cropland and cows. They grow wheat, alfalfa, corn, soybeans, and sunflowers. It's truly a family operation. Jeff's dad and brother work on the farm too. Charity homeschools five of her kids and spends most of her time organizing the family schedule, preparing family meals, and working on the farm when she can. Actually, we are attached to our animals in some sense. Um, in fact, sometimes they get more attention than our kids. <laughs> Uh, my husband came home last night. It was the kids were in their pajamas ready to go to bed and he had just needed to help care for a sick calf and so that's where he needed to be and um, it, I understand your question though. At the same time we, we know they have a purpose and to break that chain would be like someone taking their job from them. Um, it's kind of like someone who is a musician and writes songs. It's like asking them not to be a songwriter. You know it's taking that God-given um, purpose from them. So yeah, we are attached to them because they are important to us, but we're also ready to, to watch them fill their purpose.